focus at this year's tourism in Daba is on small business. And 30 enterprises have been selected from Gauteng to make their debut in Durban. ENCA, ENCA looks at one of Gauteng tourism's hidden gems. Sophia Town, synonymous with South Africa's jazz heyday, rich in culture and history. A space and time emboldened by the commitment to community. And it's this experience Ata Tours offers Gauteng's local tourism landscape. I think we are very unique here. Eh? Because we talk about the past, the present and the future. We revive the spirit of Sophia Town. Fuzwane, originally from Pumalanga, it started when she registered her company in 2009, after working as a tour operator at Museum Africa. I came to Joburg year 2000 to dig hidden treasures, to study and work. I realized where is my passion. I really like heritage. I like mingling with people. I like telling stories. She admits Sapphire Town can be a tough sell at first sight. The local tourism market is everything but easy to crack when successful models like Vilakazi Street and Orlando Towers in Soweto are practically around the corner. But Zwane is convinced the community stands to benefit. Ata Tours showcases young talent, often unemployed, and provides a training platform for aspiring vocalists, dancers and tour guides. Uh, so far, town is not on a map, but I know so my tours are so interesting, they are so vibey. So that's a challenge we have. It's difficult to create awareness, to tell people to come to our tours. You know, I've got this dream for tourism. I want everyone to know where they come from. I want this blaming game to stop where adults blaming the young ones for being ignorant. This church was built in 1934 by the... It's a unique interactive journey through the past, often by those who've lived through it. This year, Ata Tours is one of 30 small businesses that will be at Durban's Tourism in Daba. It's part of a three-year program by the Tourism Department to get SMMEs market ready. The SMMEs are a backdrop and a backbone of every thriving economy. Our townships are not just asking for crumbs out of the tourism experiences, they are the actual players. Our township experiences are cool, they are engaging, they are real, they are authentic, and they offer what visitors who are coming to South Africa are looking for. And we want to mainstream them into the overall tourism and visitor economy, and not just as a separate part and say this is a township experience. There's always a story to tell. You can't wake up and have all the money in the world. Then what are you going to tell people? How are you going to encourage people? So I will tell them, one day I'm going to sit down and tell my great-grandsons and my friends and everyone that, you know what, anyone can have a business. I'm going to inspire people. And I know I'm inspiring. For this small business, the long-term goal is simple, to be a global tourism competitor. Lauren Rose Joseph, Johannesburg.